What's up? Charles Rabe. I don't make that many videos anymore because, you know, life's been busy and whatnot. My wife. But I just want to tell you how cool. See, like, you can see the sign back here? West Town. Right there. Eckerd Park. Um, I'm telling you how cool Chicago is. So, we're just walking around the park having a great day. This dude stops me and he's like, Hey, big dog. Hey, big dog. Come here. I got something for you and your lady. And I was like, You know what? Anytime someone tells he me. He ran says, over there. I was like, Yeah. Anytime someone says, Hey, I got something in my trunk. I've lived in Chicago for a long time. Uh, I'm always interested to see what's in the trunk because, quite frankly, you never know what it's going to be. Good. You never know what's going to be, right? <laughs> it could be anything. It really could be anything in the trunk. It could be a puppy. It could be. Uh. It could be a sex toy. You don't know. Well, in this case, it was a bag of sex toys. They were brand new, and he was selling them for my lady and I. He said, "I got everything you need. You know, some for you, some for her, some for both y'all." I was like, "Man, I don't really know the going price on these toys anymore." Even though I used to work in a porn store years ago. Uh, I don't know what the price is on these anymore, but I was honestly kind of curious. Uh, I didn't buy anything, but uh, yeah, I walked through the park. Just some guy randomly had sex toys in his trunk. Love Chicago. One of the best stories was once when I was like 22, 23. Some guy was on the street, had tons of liquor. $7 a bottle, anything I wanted, I bought everything he had. So you know what? Anytime someone says, hey, I got something for you, unless they're yelling at you and it's like, it sounds aggressive, like they might have something for you, I got something special to show you. Go see what it is. Go see what it is. Go see what it is. Get murdered. Yeah. <laughs>